So now let's add in captions for images inside of Adobe Captivate. So in case there is no fluid boxes, the process is quite straightforward. So what you have to do is you can bring in an object or an image right over here. Then you go to your text right over here, click on text captions and just add in the caption right over here and arrange that out. But what we're going to do now is see the process for a fluid, fluid grid layout. So I'm just going to go around here and bring in the fluid box right over here. So I'm going to go to fluid box. Let me bring in three horizontal box right over here, just like this. I'm going to rearrange the size right over here. So I'm just going to go around and rearrange the size right over here. Now I'm going to go ar around here and I'm going to go to fluid box and then I'm going to click on vertical uh, fluid box right over here, rearrange that out as well. So I'm going to bring in an image on the center fluid box right over here. So I'm going to click on the fluid box, I'm going to bring in media, image, select the uh, image that I want to bring and open that out. So what I want to add in is a caption. So I'm going to select the fluid box again and then I'm going to click on text and click on text caption, just like this. So I didn't select the fluid box quite well, so I'm just going to delete the ca text caption right here, fluid box six, text caption right over here. And now as you select the fluid box and select text caption, you can see that the caption appears on the right. So I'm just going to see uh, beach, just like this area right over here, just like that. Now what I can do is I can realign this. You can see that now uh, the caption is on the right hand side. I want it at the bottom. So I'm going to select the fluid box right over here and then I'm going to click on properties on the right hand side. And here on the content flow, you can see that it says horizontal. So I'm just going to change it into vertical right over here. Now I can, I can come back over here and then resize this out as you can see, and then the image resizes accordingly. But there's a problem with this method as well. So right now everything seems fine, but as I resize it, you can see that now again, the image moves on to the left and the caption moves on to the right. I don't want that out. So in order to make sure that it remains consistent, I need to select the fluid box again. And along with the content flow, I need to choose the wrap option as well. So I'm going to say squeeze in a column just like this. So I'm just going to make sure that this is checked on. So vertical and squeeze in a column. And once that is done, I'm just going to resize again. And you'll be able to see that as the, uh, as the size changes, the, the caption remains underneath the image itself. So that is how it works out. And that is how you can add in captions to images inside of Adobe Captivate. So I hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.